Tai Chi Chuan Yang style of the Qingming Qing lineage. Why do we move slowly in Tai Chi Chuan or why move slowly in Tai Chi Chuan? Is it really a martial art? The reason why the form in Tai Chi Chuan is performed slowly is because of one of the main principles of the martial art is being light and sensitive. Regardless of the style, the form is performed slowly to facilitate the loosening of the tendons, ligaments and sinews. The joints need to be agile and supple. Now, this is not an easy task as, as one learns that they are holding tension in their body. Now, it is harder to achieve being light and sensitive when you move fast. The slow form allows you to realign your body structure. Once this becomes second nature, then the structure is maintained when moving fast. Because at the end of the day, fights are not slow. Now, the principles of realigning and loosening or achieving this agility or suppleness is what has health benefits. In addition, it is the harmony of the body and mind that also make Tai Chi Chuan or makes Tai Chi Chuan a lethal martial art. Like most things, a select few know the true way of this martial art as an effective form of combat and even in the age of information, a few are willing to guide their students on this martial arts true functions. Also to add, a few people are willing to go through the arduous training to achieve this high level of skill. The movements are generated when one sings the chi, inverted common, and few people know what this actually means. The sinking refers to releasing the, releasing the tension that is held by the body. Abinos to us is that we hold up tension. We do this by having our chest out, for example. In Tai Chi Chuan principles, in Tai Chi Chuan principles, one must sink the chest. This means slightly drop the sternum, allowing the breath to sink below the navel. This involves other adjustments, um, especially uh, the same adjustments you'll do if you're performing standing meditation, Zan Zhuang. By allowing the sinking motion of all the joints in the body to the ground, there is a reactionary force coming up, a thrusting force from the ground that spirals up as the tension that is released spirals down. Yin and Yang working together and thus Tai Chi, because that's what Tai Chi is, the polar the the great plurality that one side has yin and the other has yang and they interact going from yang to yin yin to yang